The United States has tried repeatedly. I'm ready to leave, dude. This town makes me bored. What are you trying to do tonight, man? I don't know, Freddy. Just want to kick it tonight, man. Maybe go see a movie or something. Dave, stop reading the funnies and finish eating your burger, bro. Nah, I'm not hungry. You still moping about that BZ, dude? You guys weren't even going out for that long. She's just a little girl, bro. Yeah, but Sandra said that we'd yeah, see I don't you. care what Sandra said. She broke up with you, forget about it. That's it, bing, bang, boom, done. We'll find a real woman and then we'll talk. Okay, we can cruise for a bit and then we're going to the movies. I'm not trying to sit inside anywhere unless there's a honey sitting next to me, come on. I'll buy you the burger you're currently eating if you'll drive me to the movies. After we cruise for an hour or two. Hi, I'm going to take my time eating this free meal. Then, we will smoke the J that's been in my pocket since this morning. Then we will cruise for BZ's. And then we will go to the movies. You better not be touching my radio. Is that shit cast yet? Almost. Kill it. Nope. In Vietnam. Dave, give me a cigarette, man. <laughs> yeah, sure. I'll buy a pack tomorrow, man. Yeah, sure. Dude, scope this bees right here. Now this is a real one. Oh, come on, man. Don't... Hey, beautiful. Haven't I seen you before someplace? And I thought the zoo was closed. Hey, come on. Why you gotta treat us like that? Like, like animals in a cage. Or maybe you're the one in the cage, and we're watching you. Fucking forget it, man. Stop being a creep. We should get to the theater. The movie's gonna start in like 15 minutes. I'm sorry. My friend thinks he's met everyone before. It's very serious Shut up, condition. Dave. It's like amnesia, but backwards. Very dangerous. Shut up, Dave. Hey, Four Eyes. You're cuter than you look. Thanks. You're a dick, Dave. <laughs> Movie time, bro.
That subtitle thing sucked, but the action was pretty good. Yeah, it was cool. I thought the violence was a little over the top, though. Yeah, but would you have kept watching if there wasn't a dope-ass fight scene every five minutes? No, Me but... neither. I would have fallen asleep while they talked it out in gibberish. But he killed so many people. And he killed them in cold blood. I mean, how can you be down with that kind of hero? Especially because he's a cop. The safest kill is on someone who's defenseless. I don't blame him. I just had a problem with the fact that he fired way too many bullets. No way he had a magazine that big. That was their way of telling the audience the violence was stylized, like a comic book. It's the only redeeming part of the film. Don't give me that hippie shit, Dave. If you had to choose between living and dying, you would choose to live. Yeah, but that has nothing to do with the overabundance of violence in the film. In the tea house scene, he shoots first and continues to murder people. He's surrounded on all sides by dudes with guns. The only advantage he has is surprise. Okay, I'm just saying a true hero never shoots an unarmed man and never shoots a man in the back. Maybe in the old west. But nowadays, if you wait for the other guy to draw, you're going home in a body. Because <laughs> you're going to the army, you're some kind of big manly man now? You couldn't kill a man and you know it. Especially if he's about to shoot fucking bullets at you. No, Dave, I do my fucking job! I'm going in the army to help protect our country. No, no, you're going into the army because you play with your BB gun too much. Dave, you're a fucking dick. Man. Just because you don't have the, the balls to do what I'm doing. Don't try and pawn it off on me as some kind of moral issue, okay? You're just a fucking pussy, man. Go to college already. At least I'm not gonna end up dead in a foreign country anytime soon. Okay, well if I do go into combat, and I am Scott, at least I don't have to listen to your fucking jazz music anymore. That's a red light! Fred, look. Dude. What should we do, bro? I think she said help me just as I looked up, so follow them, I guess. You're really trying to get into it with some stranger right now. Freddy, that guy just hit her in the face. Yeah, but what are you gonna do about it? Whatever happened to chivalry, motherfucker? I'm tied with the dinosaurs, bro. Just fucking follow them, all right? They're going pretty fast. Where the fuck are they going? 1.45 on a Saturday night, I don't know, man. P possibly home. I'm not gonna follow him home, Dave. I don't think they're going home. Hey, look, you should slow down, okay? I see him, dude. Chill the fuck out. All right, what should we do now? This was your idea, man. I fucking knew you didn't want to fight. Fight? No, let, let's just let's just get out and ask if they need help with their car or something. There's no fighting involved. We should just call the cops. No, fuck the police, man. I've got it. Oh, God, this good. I'll just sit here watching your ass. Are you kidding me? If you are a man at all, you will follow me right fucking now. Excuse me, sir. Just wait a second. Excuse me, sir. Hey, man, are you having trouble hey, with your tires or something? Out of oh, what the fuck, man? <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Ah! Please don't kill him! Get back in the fucking car! Hey!